don't want to blaze, you 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 don't want to What's going on? It's your boy Bang, and I'm back in the house, man. This is the BMF episodes three and four recap, and then I'm gonna talk about them uh, the, the up and coming shows. You know what I'm saying? The House of the Dragon, the Power Book Ghost Four, and all that. And you know, seeing this how it's gonna be the last Power Book Ghost. That's that's crazy because they want some more money, and it's gonna be a, a fourth spinoff with uh, Tommy and Ghost too. You feel me? But I'm going to go ahead and get into this BMF, man. You know what I'm saying? It was crazy. Now, when I when I left off on, on part two, you know what I'm saying? A lot a lot of stuff was happening. You know what I'm saying? Somebody somebody called up the people on... Um, somebody, no. Yeah, somebody called the people on, on the... the uh, they think that it was Markeisha. They called the people on um, T and his girl. You know what I'm saying? And long, long story short on that one, stuff was going, stuff was going real left, you know what I mean? And they had got the, they had was going to try to get a new connect or whatever. But uh, episode three, it, it kicked back off, right? You know what I'm saying? And episode three, it's, it, it, it's, it started off with this nigga, um, the meat, Meech, Big Meech was, um, was walking up to, um, What's that nigga name? Two Chains Crib. What's going on, OD? What up, Jay Renrick? What up, Warren? I was going on. Y'all hit that like button as y'all come through. But look, though, like I was saying, Big Meech came up to the dough and came up to Two Chains dough, and he was it. It, it looked it. They was. They, I guess the Miami niggas was robbing him, so it looked so fake. But Meech was Meech up itchy and started shooting at them niggas. You know what I'm saying? All right, all right, Boogie. I'll holler at you, bro. But uh, yeah, he can't act, but he still, he still, he still, you know what I'm saying? To me, that was suspect, right? Because I'm like, he started, he started shooting that niggas, and you ain't even shooting. How you getting robbed and beat up in your own crib that easily, though? When when I pull up, why it ain't happen? You know what I'm saying? Why I ain't pull up and then them niggas was, was gone or something like that? But then, anyway, that happened, and he was salty. They took all. They took. They took most of the merch or whatever. So he ended up going back to the club, talking to old girl like I almost got hit. But but keep in mind that the end of last the episode two, they had already got their vibe on, and he had got up with the new connect. And the new connect don't like T. Remember that. But any of it though, getting back to episode, this episode three, you know he get up with old girl in the club like man, you sure you ain't tell this nigga. Why you like, why you like, why you like, bro, did you set me up? Because I, I kill you if you set me up. You know what I'm saying? She's like, I ain't say nothing to this nigga. Woo, 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 woo. So then Neo character come up again. He like, man, what's going on? Uh, Detroit, woo, 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 woo. Everything, I ain't get to work. So he like, he like, man, nigga, it was, it was a snake job. So he like, yeah, I know. So they have a little conversation. And Meech looking at that nigga sideways. You know what I'm saying? So in the meantime, between time, they switch back over to, uh, to T. The T out there in Detroit and uh old girl trying to get up with him. Um, what's her name? Marquisha trying to get up with him. He's like, no, I got my family and hang up on her. You know what I'm saying? And after they after that happened, they, they, they swing back to, to Meach over there in Atlanta. And he telling all the niggas they gotta, they gotta, you know what I'm saying? It's a new connect happening. They finna get bread and all of that, right? And stuff, and you know, stuff finna start looking up once this connect dropped them, dropped them bricks off on. Okay, and two chains like man, I'm ready to ride on these niggas, man. They killed my cousin. Now they killed my nephew and this, this, and that. And I, I ain't gonna be at what's the name. So two chains was basically telling this nigga, everybody roll with Meech. Meech went and pawned his watches and gave all them niggas some money. You feel me? Two chains turned it down, was like, nigga, I ain't nigga, I ain't studying you no more, pretty much. I ain't with this no more. It's time to kill these niggas or whatever. He like, you gotta wait, bro. He's, he was like, well, I'm going to get mad without you. He said, well, it's going to be, you're going to be pretty much done if you don't eat with me, nigga. You feel me? You're going you gonna to have to get your, you're going to have to work with me, nigga. 
And two chains was like, you know what? I'm out of here, nigga. I ain't worried about none of that. You feel me? I ain't with this because his homies, his homies turned on two chains sitting in there with me in that, in that meeting that they had, pretty much. You know what I'm saying? So um the same thing happened to T. Niggas started leaving T. You know what I'm saying? T had, you know what I'm saying, one of the niggas he grew up from the grew up with. He had him, he had him look at, he had him look at somebody. My bad. He had him, he had him look at somebody and watch and watch out and watch over what, what was going on, what dude was doing, Henry or whatever. The the little stud over there or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So that happened. And that was cool, right? So back, back, back to the back at the ranch, you know what I'm saying? Old girl was like, um, you um put them niggas on. They the police came over and told the dyke, man, they knew your every move. I had to do such and such. I had to whip up this and whip up that. And they knew what was going on with the ambulance or whatever. You feel me? And um, she like, so what? whoop de do. You know what I'm saying? It's your job to figure out what's going on and tell me about every, everything you know about BMF. You feel me? Um, uh, yeah. Hey, Sean Brewer, stop playing with me, bro. Y'all hit that like button. Then y'all come through, though. You feel me? So she's the cop working with the dike, pretty much. Okay, to trying to to find out everything you know about T or whatever. And keep in mind, it's still episode three. So he. Meach called his daddy there because he need his daddy to sign for the house for him. But he bring his daddy to the studio because he know he, he trying to soften his pops up so he can say yeah to um to sign to sign off on the on the house or whatever. You know what I'm saying? And he got his homie in there showing his daddy around or whatever. You know what I mean? And um, so after they do that, I believe they they went over to you know what I'm saying, Miss Flannery, which is uh. His daddy, his daddy, wife, they going through a divorce. Her friend telling her, man, you better get with that doctor, nigga. I see how he looking at you, girl. Woo, 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 and all that, right? So they, uh, so basically T finds out what's going on and where the, where the, where the hit niggas at, you know what I'm saying, with the, with the ambulance or, or whatever, to, to stop they, to stop the bricks with the, with the dike and whatever, and the, the cop. Cause you know what happened them happened them move the weight. Meantime, between time, uh, Meach's daddy was like, "Hell no, nah. what up, Alex or Hernandez? What's going on with it, brother?" Meantime, between time, what up, what up, Slick Three Forty? Pops, like, man, I gotta sleep on this or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So they kill they kill the Dyke cousin when they catch up with the ambulance. Shoot the cop, the Chinese cop, the black the black cop was there. You know what I'm saying? Was mad and everything. So he go he go report back to the dike like, man, they knew your whole route. They knew what was going on. What up, what up, official goblin? Y'all hit that like button as y'all come through. He say we they hit they hit your whole spot, man. They know exactly what was going on. So the dike was mad and they killed her cousin. So she was real mad. And so DCFS show up at the at the house on um on um T and this girl or whatever. You know what I'm saying? And it was it was all it was all good in the hood. So that's when they, they start worrying about all that 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 going on. You feel me? So they they fast forward to this little this look party thing of uh that used to go down for black music or whatever in Atlanta. And uh Meach Daddy wanted to go and all the drug dealers and stuff started going there or whatever. So they they went to do that, and his daddy was geek, he showed up and everything. And that Miami, the Miami killers and everything was there. And, and you know, he like, he like, Meach like chilling like, Dad, you, why you here, nigga? Bounce, you feel me? So Pops went bounce. He was like, nigga, do you know what this is? He was like, man, they changed everything. Nigga, do you see all these drug dealers? Do you see any artists really in here? So what tripped me out is Meach had a whole conversation with Tupac. <laughs> and the dude was supposed to be Tupac, bro. It was funny as hell, okay? That was and they, that happened there, but then they they fed they 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 spin the block over to where uh T go holler at Marquisha like why you why you put them people why you put them folks on us you know what I'm saying because she he thinking they all thinking Marquisha did it so he can get back so T can get back with her you know what I'm saying so she can get so T can get back with her um she like no I ain't do it I ain't do it or whatever so everybody skeptical everybody thinks she doing it. You know what I'm saying? So they have a conversation. He like, you right. 
I don't think you did. I don't think you would do nothing like that or whatever. Basically, he soft on her. You know, y'all know he's soft on Marquise. Um, hit that like button as y'all come through. What up, dog? What's going on, my nigga? So he, you know, he soft on Marquisha or whatever. So it, it went to it went to where it went. So they go, it's back to the ranch, back to the party where his daddy at. You know what I'm saying? The meat's telling niggas, I'm I'm gonna be the nigga that got what's the name? They like, man, I we we do good in St. Louis or whatever. Woo, 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 woo. He like, man, I'm gonna have to go check y'all out and come and come mess with y'all. You feel me? What's going on, Chris? Yeah, what's up? Appreciate that birthday uh wish, my nigga. That cash app floating on the bottom of the screen. You can hit that, you can become a member. You know what I'm saying? And you can hit the um, uh, what that damn kid, the super chat, my nigga. I appreciate all of y'all. Real talk. Let me drop that in there right quick. You feel me? Boom. He say, he say, I think the cop called CPS on Terry. Maybe, bro. You never know. But then um, old girl get back. She goes out with the doctor. Miss Flannery go out with the doctor. And he bought her some popcorn that he bought bought them when they went to prom and stuff. She like, oh man. And he like, man, I love you, girl. Woo 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 woo. So so anyway, the uh, the doctor trying to get Miss Flannery draws again. He trying to, he trying to tap that. You know what I'm saying? So that happened. Then they, it switched back to Miami. I mean to Atlanta. And the Miami killer leader nigga, he hollering at Meach and T Daddy at the thing. You know what I'm saying? And um, it it was crazy, you know what I mean. So they get they getting into it. So after everything happened, it's cra it was crazy as hell. You know what I mean. They switch over to uh, what happened was going over there in Detroit with T them. You feel me? Um, and and then nigga, they telling T like, man, they knew we was gonna be there. The cop was there. The cops that we killed one of them niggas. We stole all of this. We stole all of that. And the T like, God damn, that's crazy, dog. Woo, 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 woo. You know, such and such and such and such. You know, niggas going crazy with it. Hold on. Shout out to my nigga Chris Hampton for that cash app. I appreciate you, my brother. Real talk, my nigga. You feel me? Um, and uh, so then they they T like, okay, let's chill or whatever. But then they they get to the to they go switch it back to Atlanta and Meach and his daddy is talking with the Miami killer nigga. So when Meach figure out he the Miami killer nigga, he like, man, stuff get real wicked up in there. Niggas start shooting. The police start going up in there. Niggas start getting down. You know what I'm saying? And it went crazy. It was like, but, 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 but. Nigga was going crazy up in there. You know what I'm saying? So they 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 showed that scene happen. You know what I'm saying? Pop stole on a nigga. You feel me? Uh, Meach start whipping on niggas. You know, they start going crazy, right? So then they they fast forward back to T. T like, man, you know what I'm saying? Everything is all good. Telling her, yeah, we got to connect, but I don't, I don't, you know what I'm saying? Stuff is going crazy. Marquisha, like, let me get some of that. So he over her new house, trying to, he trying to, he trying to stroke. He said, I know that. Hey, what I had Hey, we, we, we good, we good, Chris, man. It's all look, it's the thought that count, my nigga. Appreciate you. Y'all hit that like button as y'all come through. But look though. So he finna bust down Marquisha again. Mama busting the door like the CPS is happening. That break up families. Woo 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 woo. So pops is like, okay, it is what it is. So he he drove. He driving his daddy to the to the thing. His daddy signed for the uh the house, and he had to go home or whatever. You know what I'm saying? And um, they they spin they spin the block back to back to Detroit or somewhere in Michigan. Where the dike is the dike is getting licked up and sucked up by a broad. And she tell her cousin get mad, like, man, these niggas out here walking around and then killed our cousin. So she like, look, bro, get over there and suck that nigga meat, right? He like, she like, if I want to suck meat, I stay with my boyfriend. She was like, if you wanna, if you don't wanna die, you better get over there and suck that nigga meat, right? So she made it with the little blade she got, go over there and suck her cousin up. You know what I'm saying? It was trippy, bro. You feel me? So Meach end up, Meach end up getting old, uh Meach end up catching up with uh catching up with uh what's that nigga? The, the singer nigga, Neo. He snatched Neo up out the car and started beating his ass like nigga, you set me up. Wop, 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 wop. Beat his ass like nigga. So he was like, and Neo was like, I'm gonna get your ass light skinned ass, nigga. You know what I'm saying? It was funny as hell, right? So he do that and Meach, Meach simping with this damn stripper bra. So he get the stripper bra and take the stripper bra all the way 
back to the crib or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Tell his homie to get up with him. You know, his homie wanted to kill, he wanted to kill that nigga uh Neo, right? And it was trippy. You feel me? So they 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 go back. What up, Duck No Schmuck? What up, HM3? Y'all hit that like button. So he wanted to kill that nigga. So he, he was like, no, nah, let him live, nigga. Let him live. So they spin it back to Detroit at the Flannery crib. So Miss Flannery talking crazy. She like, good night, uh, whatever, whatever, whatever uh they daddy name is. I keep forgetting that nigga name. But uh, at the at the end, at the end of the day, right? This dude, he seen a check from the doctor. You know what I'm saying? And his heart was hurt after that. He he looked up there and it hurt his it hurt his heart. And the, the the officer dude called his son up in there. His son came up in there with a black eye and he was limping, like somebody somebody took his soul. You know what I mean? They might have took his manhood. So he was like, "It's gonna be okay, son. The the super dude is with you." Yeah, he started crying and stuff. And he got real real mad. So they they showed that part. You know what I mean? And then Meach was like, "Oh man, girl." You know what I'm saying, stripper girl. Let me get some of that 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 damn that that cooter cat. You did, and um, it was it was trippy because T drove outside. He he he, he followed the cop to the Audi home. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Mom name was Lucille. I, I and Charles Charlie. Yeah, Charlie Charles is dude named the daddy name. Yeah, my bad. What up, Doug? No smoke. What's good with it, man? What's the haps? It did, it did, it did check it, check it out, right? So what he what, what he did is he ran T ran up on a cop like, yeah, nigga, we know what's going on. We know you working with that bra. Woo, 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 woo. He said, nigga, BMF running the streets. If you gonna roll with us and get rolled over. The cop looked at that nigga and said, I'd rather get rolled over, nigga. And then you know a job. We got that money on the line. I don't know what I'm saying. At least you wish me luck. You feel me? So that that was crazy, bro. That was part. That was that was the third episode. Now the fourth episode, stuff get real wicked with it. Then, bro, you know what I'm saying? It say the return, and the, the fourth one is return of the of the, of the particle son. You know what I'm saying? Because the um the the Mexican niggas they was like, orale vato chico maridero, and they they sent him the new connect sent him the money, and the dude said they wanted he wanted. Me to go down there and pick it up, not T because they don't like T, right? So he was like, he was like, Julio, Julio Cesar Chavez. They said twenty five hundred. No, he he said he said two fifty, and the Mexican mixed it up and told the nigga twenty five hundred. So me get down there, and say what up to everybody, and everything was all good in the hood. But what they do, what they tell, what they he, first. Let me let me say this. He started off, it started the episode start off showing you what two chains, how two chain was disloyal and said he ain't messing with him no more. And then Meach get up with the stripper bra. It's like, man, I gotta go to Detroit. You know what I'm saying, baby? So such and such and such and such. We gonna chill with you, baby. You know what I'm saying? You you gonna be here. I'm gonna put some men in my house. You ain't gotta worry about that. So she like, man, let me suck you up and do all this. He like, no, don't suck me up first. Let me let me bust tongue with you. And then you can suck me up and we can juice. You know what I'm saying? So he he really really he really caking it for this this stripper bro, and I don't I don't think bro, it's crazy I, it's crazy how how he falling for this bro. It's a stripper bro. You don't fall for no stripper bro like that. So he make it make it making his way to Detroit or whatever, and um, they 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 flip over to uh to T and his baby mama. And they they worry about the 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 laws getting on DCFS. She eating greens and all of that, you know what I mean? And the homies and everything. She leave and then Meach walk up in the restaurant and and T get mad like, man, I can't believe you here, nigga. He like, nigga, you tripping, nigga. I told you, I think Marquisha called them folks on y'all, nigga. You know what I'm saying? He like, no, man, whatever. I don't even want to talk about it no more, nigga. You know what I'm saying? So he treating his little brother as always. You know, T acting like a big ass sissy. You know, they playing spades or whatever. And um, it 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 be what it be. So he so they 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 spin it over to the cop talking to the Chinese bro, and he tell the Chinese bro like, look, right? You know whatever I'm doing, I'm doing for my family. So you better don't don't play with me. You feel me? And if I do whatever it takes for my family, so if you get in my way, I will kill you, Ling Ling. 
I'll be having some Ming Mong Chuck Bok Sui. You feel me? And it's it's crazy, bro. You know what I mean? It's crazy how how they just how how he like he really checked her, bro. You feel me? He really checked her, bro. Like Chinese Ling Ling. I know you was my partner and everything, but you better you better believe I end your ass for my shorty. So uh Meech, Meech end up talking to the dead oh remember the remember uh what's the crazy nigga? Y'all remember that crazy nigga? I forget that crazy nigga name, the black one that he shot in the stomach. Who was a crackhead now? And um he killed he killed Cash Doll or whatever. And uh they had a child. So Meech was out there taking care of the, back there taking care of both of them. You know what I'm saying? Saying, I'm gonna make sure you get in the biggest college, she wanna be a lawyer. So they 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 spin over to the club where uh Marquisha old, her old husband used to be at or whatever. You know what I'm saying? And um uh, they they get over there and she talking to the mayor nigga or, or the judge so the DCFS case can get dropped. You know what I'm saying? He tell he like, hell no, I ain't doing it. And remember, and so when they finna do that, T slide the money like nigga, I'll pay whatever, I pay what I weigh. You feel me? You feel me? I, he said, I, he said, I pay what I weigh. So he put the money over there in front of her. You know what I'm saying? Like, look, check in front of the judge. Like, nigga, I got that dough, nigga. I'm walking tall up in here. And then the dyke bra come in like, nigga, you know who my daddy is, homeboy. You better get up out of here talking to this little baby nigga right here. And then he tried, she, the dyke tried to hit on Marquisha, had tried to hit on Lala. She like, you better get up out of here. Woo, 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 woo. So they like, damn, it messed up. So... They switch over to, to the to the Flannery house. Charles in there lifting weights. Like, yeah, baby. Ooh, I'm out here. I'm swole, baby. She walk in like, ooh, Charles. Ooh, how you doing, Charles? You know what I'm saying? What them ducking hives, Charles? You know what I'm saying? He like, how was work? She was like, same old, same old. He was like, I made you a plate downstairs, baby. Yeah, go check it out. And she like, ooh, thank you. And then she started fanning herself, walking out like, ooh, I want to get his finger. You know what I'm saying? So they they flip over, they flip over to uh to the dyke and the cop. Like, nigga, it's your job to figure out Meech is in town. She told him Meech was in town, so he he telling Meech, right? He he tell Meech and the cops get a get a lead on something, and they go they go somewhere. But the plane come down and Meech go out there and meet the dude and get the twenty five hundred. He say, no, nah, cry. No, that's just facts, though. You know what I'm saying? Mama, look. Hey, this episode four was already out, bro. Episode four came out. I seen, I told you I see it a day before it come out. So he 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 uh meets out at the plane, getting the, the uh, he he switched it up. He said, Hey, what are they though? You know what I'm saying? I said 250 bricks, not 2500. You know what I'm saying? So he get the 2500. He like, damn, he called me. She say, no, he called T. He me called T like, man, get everybody. I got my niggas coming in from Atlanta. I got my niggas coming in from, from Cleveland. I got my niggas coming in from everywhere. We finna sell this dope for half the price. You know what I'm saying? But they still, you know, they were still was gonna recoup because they had to do it fast. You know what I'm saying? And um, it was crazy. You see it say episodes three and four recap, nigga. So the pilot get there like, I'm not helping you do nothing, nigga. I'm just here. Julio said 2,500. That's what I brought. You know what I mean? So me start getting everybody together. So, and then T start getting all his people together too. So me sees, me goes over there and he sees this dude with this truck. He like, nigga, I'll get your truck back to you later on the day. You want to make some bread, nigga. I ain't going to do nothing. I just need your, I'll bring your truck back to you in 24 hours, nigga. And I'm going to give you some bread too. So he get a nigga the bread and he take the truck and load it up. But the cop watching him the whole time, right? So once they show the cops watching him the whole time, it spin the block. They spin the block all the way over to the Flannery house. And Miss Flannery walk in and they daughter is sitting between the nigga legs that nigga from church, that little boy from church, and she got she got two friends over there. They got that's like boyfriend, girlfriend, double date. They in there playing Mortal Kombat. You know what I'm saying? So I'm get over here. Y'all gonna hear to see it. But look though, they doing all that. She was like, boy, if you don't get she was like, if you don't get these goddamn niggas up out my house, girl, and you better fix your face. Woo, 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 woo. I told you my friends was coming over, mama. She was like, girl, I'll beat them. Woo, Lord. Right? So 
Anyway, that, that scene cut, you know what I mean? So they go back to, to me putting the bricks in the truck and they getting all them niggas together. And the CPS come lady coming, the, the DCFS lady coming to the to the um to the uh to the family restaurant. So they go in the family restaurant, he tell all them niggas to order ribs and order 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 macaroni and all that. So he doing all that and he and he and T dealing with the uh he dealing with the C, the the child the not the child the DCFS people. You know what I'm saying, and it switched back over to, to Meech. Now Meech in the in the in the um the pilot is riding together in his truck. The the the, the pilot got to be back in the air within the, in the next 24 hours. So they get they got to move all this dust and get all that money, and move all this coke, and do everything they doing right. It's crazy, you know what I'm saying. So they see, so they pull up in this this place. The, the, the uh, pilot have to use the bathroom and get a cup of coffee or whatever, right? So they pull up in the joint. And then a the bald head officer pulling in there right behind him saying like, like, yeah, nigga, I'm on your tail. I got you. So then the popos pull in too. And me start getting nervous. So he called he called T and tell him, man, look, we walk the bam. Stuff is going on. I got this bald head nigga following me, such and such and such. But he did he did it with the CPS lady too, the DCFS lady too. And the DCFS lady leave, and everything going, so everything go good. So, what Meech do is call the the pilot. The pilot go talk to the officers in there, and what he do when the when the when the, the pilot come out, the two officers go over there and get on the the the, uh, the black police dude, right? Yeah, yeah, detective, yeah, detective Brian. Good one, good one, um, Alex, detective Brian. It's over there like, man, I'm an officer. They like, show your badge. He like, I ain't got my, my badge, but I can show you. When he went to reach. They was like, keep your hands where I can see you, nigga. I'm going to blow your damn head off. You know what I'm saying? So they snatch him up out the car. He like, man, they was spelling, and that truck is full of drugs. And the pilot got in the truck. So they did, they did not let it, they, they didn't let that bother him. You feel me? So he getting locked up, and it was cool. So they switched back to the Fennery house. And Charles in there, he he putting the drywall up. You know what I'm saying? He doing this dude. He like, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So so mama walked by. The the mama Flannery walked by. She say, ooh, you doing the drywall? Ooh, what's going on? He like, I'm just doing what I, I'm doing. What you asked me to do, Lucille? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm thinking, yeah, I'm I'm not, I'm not gonna stop till I'm able to hit that again, right? So she write, if your last name ain't Flannery, you can't go up these stairs, right? So he like I say he like yeah what you trying to say I ain't bringing no bras up in the crib why you doing that you know what I mean he like she like I'm not thinking about you Charles woo, 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 woo. and he like oh well I seen that check you got from that doctor you been out there kicking it with him I just want to keep it real I'm trying to make it happen with you you know what I'm saying and she was like whatever I'm going upstairs Charles I kept it real with you and I think you tweaking nigga so they they, they fast forward over there to the to the dike and the dike like nigga what happened. Woo, 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 woo. He was like, what we gonna do about uh uh the uh, officer officer Brian that show up? She was like, I knew I couldn't trust that damn cop. You feel me? Woo 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 woo. We ain't gonna she he saw the dudes, the cousin was like, Man, what we gonna do about these BMF niggas? She said, Nothing, nigga. These niggas got that got that work. So they go and they flood the streets. They flood Cincinnati, Cleveland, and Atlanta, and they do it. Then no, they ain't head back to Atlanta yet. But all the boys, they they washed the money and, and did the work. And they spent over back to the club where Marquisha be at. And she catch up with that judge and was like, man, I got all these photos of you, of you juicing on all these girls and taking drug money from these, these drug lords, right? So she so she made the show the DCFS case go away. So she did that, right? And dude, dude looked at mad. So they they counted all the money, got all the money up out of there, had the hat, and then sent the pilot on his way. But then Lucille go over there to get some um some sex books. You know what I'm saying? Sex, she got she go all the way she go all the way to the doctor again downtown to get some sex books and, and uh uh what you call that pregnancy what pre for the for they, for whatever the, the the stuff is what you get when you can't have kids. Okay, uh, like rubbers and 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 uh, sex talk, sex education talk for her, her daughter. So she go see him, right? 
And she was like, let me tell you the truth. Charles don't know, and I ain't talked to Charles about this, so I just want to give you some. Okay, that's basically what she did up in there and said to him. She was wet in dark and hands, okay? And they holding hands and she leave, right? So like I said, um, Meech, Meech them, they had a dinner they had to go to with the family. But you know T, T went to go see Marquisha first because she gave him some good news. So he like, man, we can't go out to dinner, but I can, but I can bang you. You know what I'm saying? So T gets some coochie from Marquisha. And then go back to the, to the dinner with Meech. You know what I'm saying? And um, after that happened, they go to the dinner. And the little, the little daughter, the daughter, they look, the little sister up there. And she was she started telling all they been. She was like, oh, y'all on my back. Because uh, I got a little boy. My first boyfriend got killed in front of me. Uh, woo, woo, woo. And, and Meech, you got... Four kids by, by two different day baby mamas and, and nigga T, you out here banging Marquisha and she done called the CPS on everybody, on the kids and daddy, you sitting, while you sitting up here talking, you bang Miss Mabel and, and, and mama, you ain't say nothing when you was giving the gloss high and shaking your little thing to, to the doctor. So she got, she just told on everybody and everything and they made her go upstairs so meach went and talked to her made it all good or whatever you know what i'm saying and um so mama put on some clothes and left she got all jiggy put lipstick on and went to the doctor office it was late night and he, he was like she was like me and charles is divorced and woo, i ain't been honest with you and i just want to give it to you he was like yeah come on baby and soon as he was gonna slide it in she was like no i gotta go I got to go. So she, he almost put the head in, but then she left, left the man on stuff. He was like, I got all the time in the world for you, baby. You know what I'm saying? And uh, so they showed them niggas playing the game of the kids in the house playing the game. Mama come in and was like, I appreciate you. I, I was good seeing my babies. Y'all still my babies and all that. And then Charles come out the bathroom with a towel on to myself. Yeah, what's up? Where you go? You happy? Yeah. This nigga, this nigga to put oil on. You know what I'm saying? He tried to get her. You know what I'm saying? And she like, I'm okay. I just went out. Whoa, 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 whoa. And he said, he said, yeah, that's good. Good night, Lucille. And walk by. You know, like, yeah, I'm swole, baby. You feel me? And she like, woo. You know what I'm saying? Flattery. You know, and the nigga from the cross street come over like, man, I'm getting out of the game. I got my kids. And then uh that nigga T was told, he told um he told Meech, I'm coming to Atlanta with you, right? So everything was going good. And then Meech get a call from 2 Chains, Like, yeah, man, I just want to say, 2 Chains, like, I want to, he say, he say, you peep the pull-up bar? Big facts. The nigga say, the nigga say, um, 2 Chain, like, yeah, man, I'm my bad for being disloyal or whatever. And, you know, it's all good. And can I get back on? You going to put me on when you get out here? The boys told me what you did and everything else. And Meech was like, I got you when I get back. And I'm bringing my brother up here. So Meech and then the camera cut to that Miami nigga. So Meech just switched ass. I told y'all niggas that nigga was a snake, bro. I told y'all that nigga was a snitch. That nigga was a true snitch. So he get with the Miami boys. You know what I'm saying? They just set him up. And, and, and the Miami niggas talking and them Haitian niggas talking about 2 chains in the car. They going to kill him too. You feel me? So it's crazy. This nigga mad as hell and set, it's just set niggas up, bro. You know what I'm saying? That's how I know that they set that nigga up, bro. And it was, it was it's crazy as hell, bro. And you know what? Go, I got that money on the line. So I'm going to die. And we should raise my You know what I'm saying? It went, it, went, it went crazy, man. You know what I'm saying? So that's I'm going to drop that link, bro. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? See what y'all want to say, what y'all thought about the episodes, and is y'all watching this series. You know what I'm saying? This series is crazy, man. You know what I'm saying? This series is real crazy out here. He said, I want to know what song that was at the end. I don't know what song it was at the end. You know what I'm saying? They they be they be picking a hey, 50 be picking some some good some good songs, bro. I ain't even gonna lie. You feel me? And it, it's it's crazy, bro. It's crazy out here. You know what I'm saying? But I, like I said, I think it's going to be real interesting. So they show the next one. 
and that they they gonna be they gonna be it's gonna be a lot more action shootouts. You know what I'm saying? A whole lot of drug dealing and gang banging. I'm with it. You feel me? And of course, it's structured. Some of this stuff is added on. Some of it is is, is not. You know what I mean? Some of it is. It it, it just it just is what it is, bro. You know what I mean? It's cool. It's cool. It's cool business. You dig? Um. And we uh like I like I said, I'm, I'm a, so nobody wanna come up and talk about it. So I appreciate it. I'm gonna move on to the next stuff. And you are you already know, bro. You know, you know, I'm 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 in the mix. I'm wait, I've been waiting on this stuff. You know what I'm saying? This stuff, this stuff is um it's extra crazy. And like like I'm I'm with this. This was a three and a four. And what's going on here? What's this right here? Boom. So here we go right here. It say all must choose. It's something called a house of dragons. Everybody was saying it was postponed and pushed back and that it wasn't coming out. But nigga, this June, nigga, this June is coming back. You feel me? And, and you got and you gotta choose a side. And she like, nigga, I'm riding for my daddy, nigga. This is that's my throne. You feel me? It's my throne, and I'm about to get him on. You feel me? Let me see who this is. Hold on. And they, she, she like, man, I'm riding for mine. You know what I mean? And you know they, so it's about to be a whole, a whole bloodbath going on out there, bro. You know what I'm saying? And I'm, and I'm with it. You know what I mean? I'm super with it. I don't see, I don't see how you could not like this series. This series is some serious, and I can't, I can't wait. I can't wait till the, I can't wait till it drop. You know what I mean? Everybody was trying to say, oh, it's not coming out. They gonna wait to see it. He say, uh, House of Dragons about to be crazy. Yeah, I do, bro. He say, yeah, and it, it is about to be crazy. You know what I'm saying? And 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 that and that's and that's wild, bro. You feel me? I think they um it's it's a it's a lot of stuff that's going on that's that that's in the mix that people is is getting real, real confused about what's going on. But I'm here to I'm here to let y'all know what the deal is. You feel me? I'm a, I'm gonna give you the real. You feel me? Um, where's it? Let me see. Is this it? Hold on. Let me see. Let me see. No, that's that's not it. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. It is this one. Yeah. So like like I said, and of course. They said the, the the Rings of Power season two. They said that that got canceled, but it's not canceled. It's coming out in 2024. You know what I'm saying? They say building on the trap in the initial season, the production for the season two was already completed before the the SAG AFTA strike steering cleared. It's cleared of any potential delays, bro. And that was March 1st. So you better believe that's probably gonna. They was waiting for. The House of Dragon to release, so they probably gonna put it out counter like counter that like after that. You know what I'm saying? So that that's what's coming up. I'm interested in seeing that. I can't wait to that drop. Um, and then they said they was they say the network confirmed Wednesday that developing the Power prequel series Origins and the following story it's, it's it's Ghost and Tommy. They say played in the original Power by Omari and Joseph Sakura. So I don't know if that's that's gonna really happen or whatever. But uh, they said that's in the mix. They said the 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 uh, it's the end of Power Book. You know what I'm saying? They said season four is going to be split into two parts. The first part of the final season will debut June on the seventh of June, 2024, coinciding with the 10th anniversary of Power. It debuts on debut on Stars. The second part will drop September 6, 2024, and that's going to be the end of that little, that little fruity nigga that killed his daddy. But that's it's coming out, bro. You know what I mean? They they wanted too much money, and now that's what they get. It's over with, bro, and that is the news. You dig? That is what I got for y'all. He says, I see they canceled Young Tommy and Ghost. Oh, I don't know, bro. Maybe they did. Maybe they didn't. You know what I'm saying? But that's it. I had to, I had to get y'all, and I know the recap was condensed. You know what I'm saying? I, didn't, I wasn't too thorough. I didn't have the pictures, but that's a lot of pictures, man. That's That would have been a big-ass PowerPoint. I'm going to do the... um. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna recap five for sure. But I had a PowerPoint so y'all can see the visual. You know, appreciate all of y'all for coming out, hitting that like button. Oh man, you know it's early. 
you know, and I got the uh the pre the pregame coming up, and then of course y'all know the Lakers uh play tonight. So that's what it is. And you know what? He say no more using Lucille Flannery voice. <laughs> why, why, <Kai? laughs> She was like, she was like, Whoo. <laughs> hey, it's funny, bro. That she got this big old attitude. She won again and then uh, what he supposed to do. You know what I'm saying? He say, how many times skips for the House of Dragons season two? I don't know, Noel. Maybe none. You never know. You never know. But some something's gonna happen where where it, it happens. It, you know, I think they follow in a book too, bro. So that's that that's that's real too. Since they they follow in the book, so you gotta you gotta look at it like that too. You know what I mean? So whatever, however they did, they gonna pick up on the book. I I believe they gonna follow the book. Is still again. I don't know how much time gonna skip in between, but that's just what I think gonna happen. You know. And again, like I said, I appreciate all of y'all, man. And then I had to do this to get this, you know, get it on out the way because. You know, they was asking for it. Some people was asking for it. Boom, here we go. You got it. And I'm going to get it to y'all a little later on, man. I appreciate all of y'all. And uh, like I said, man, y'all be good out there. You did. I'm going to catch y'all on the next one. Let's get it. Blaze, you don't want to blaze. You don't want to blaze.